Right now, though, it's time for the Alan Nursall experience. And I mean, when it comes to extreme machines, if there's one person who's going to have this covered, it's got to be Alan. So what does he have? I heard he's got a machine that looks a whole lot like a snowmobile on a summer lake. Welcome to Grand Rapids, Michigan, where sunshine means relaxing on the lake, hanging out on the boat. Wait a second. Since when do I relax? Now that's more like it. Enter the jet blade. I guess it would be the mix between a snowmobile and a sea dew. You got to give snowmobile or something to do on the water. What sort of makes the jet blade unique is that it starts in the water submerged and then it comes out in planes on three skis. Josh is part of a four-man team putting the ski back in jet ski, all in the name of a college project? We uh, all lived together, so we figured it was a natural team to form. We were all mechanical engineers. We all liked watercraft vehicles, and so we're like, all right, this is what we went with. I took it three weeks' worth of meetings just to figure yeah. out what to make. Yeah. They got an A, but no one outside this super team has ever taken it for a spin. Until today. Call me Professor Nursel. <laughs> so, Zach, Josh. Hey, how's it going? It's going well. I know I'm supposed to ride it, but it doesn't look ready to ride. <laughs> it's actually ready to ride. We're just doing a few finishing touches here, getting it ready for you today. It looks like a snowmobile. It doesn't ride on snow, though. So this is the guts in here. This is the power plant, right? Yeah, yeah. This is actually an engine out of a, uh, a 1979 wet bike. What's a wet bike? It's an old, old watercraft that they, it was actually in one of the James Bond films that it debuted, and uh, they kind of died off a little bit. Well, we, we found one, and it had the uh, the engine that we needed, as well as the pump in the rear ski is actually from the wet bike as well. So we took that and built a custom body around that. What makes it a jet blade? I guess what makes it a jet blade is we really, the, the blade kind of comes from almost the hydrofoil design of, their, of the skis. There's three skis that it rides on. You have the two in the front, and then there's one in the back here. And uh, so that's that's the blade section of it. And then the jet, there's actually a jet pump in the back. If you want to come around here, you can look at that. Yep. You can see here. It there's intakes a... from the bottom down here. Mm -hmm. The intake rate is right there, and it comes up and shoots right back out. Now, this is a little bit different, where as a jet boat or a jet ski, the jet pump itself will actually turn to maneuver the vehicle. And this actually uses the skis in the front to direct the craft where you want it to go. How do you know it's the best design? We don't, actually. This was our very first prototype, so the um, thing we might do in the future is test out more skis to see how they react in the water. This beast is a prototype, and I'm your test pilot. You are. You're going to try it out for us today. <laughs> yep. Tell me somebody else has driven it. Yeah, we have. The whole team's taken it out. It's a point of honor. The two prongs go in the holes. After a few last-minute tweaks, it's time to take this project from the classroom to the water. One, two, three, what does it matter? Get your, and get your workout. Now for the hardest part, getting on. How do you get on this thing? When I get on it, you're usually a little lower in the water, so you're floating in the water. This thing's floating in the water. You want to sort of make sure you're balancing out. You try to scoot forward as soon as possible. Okay. So it's it's all about keeping it upright, and it wants to wobble. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You got to oh, have golly. some balance to get on. So what's the instruction again? <laughs> Knee here. Foot, try to put your foot on the outside and as work your way up. As quickly as possible. Oh, you what can the, take your time. What but... could possibly go wrong? <laughs> sort of start shimming your way forward. Oh, hold on. Ah! Feeling good about this. Feeling good about Third this. <laughs> what about the seventh time? Whoops. After yet another failed attempt, we decide to call for backup. Yep. Now I have pontoons. <laughs> Here we go. Hey guys, what am I doing wrong? I'll give it, you gave it a good amount of gas. Maybe don't lean back quite as far. Okay. You take it off like a wheelie there. But so, there's, you almost there's, had it. There's a lot of technique here, a lot of weight balance, a lot yeah. of weight transfer yeah. required. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. Forward. All right, go a little more forward. Oh. 
I'm not man enough to tame this machine. But it's cool. But it's crazy. What do you think, guys? Did it pass? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. awesome. Man. Great. Awesome. An A plus for Team Jetplane, and a barely passing grade for me. Back to school I go.